Hey everybody, William Lark here for Easy Fan Page Creator. And uh, I wanted to make a quick little overview video to show you exactly how easy and simple it is. And that, for real, anyone can now build quality fan pages in minutes, in a fraction of the time it used to take, with no programming knowledge whatsoever. So uh, let's get started. Uh, once you buy the script and you install it, which there's, in, there's uh, installation instructions included, but the shortness, this is, like I said, just a little overview to show you how the actual program works. Uh, once you install it, this is where we're going to log into our control panel, okay? So the uh, name here is admin, and my password, I picked this during installation, which you'll, you'll do too. Log in. Now, once in the control panel, we're at the dashboard. This will bring us to the dashboard. That's our main place where we're going to do our editing and everything on our pages. Below here, you'll see pages inside your account. These are demo uh, fan page templates already set up. All you got to do is click the edit and edit them in uh, the um, editor, which is basically like a WordPress style editor. I'll show you that shortly. But uh, next, you have settings. Under settings, we'll be able to change the uh, template color and we'll be able to turn on and off the split testing and I'll show you how what that is and how that works shortly okay next you have support <coughs> excuse me now under support this is basically like a, uh, a help section question and answers you know the questions you have here's the answers to them um, you'll see there's a lot of text but here when you click on the question mark you have video tutorials okay and these video tutorials will walk you step by step th through everything, how to set it up and uh, implement it onto your fan page in Facebook, okay? So let's go back to the dashboard real quick. Okay, as you can see, these are the pages, what you would do, uh, you know, you can rename them whatever you want. Uh, they don't have to be named squeeze page, uh, very one, you, you name them whatever you want. But um, I'll show you inside here. Okay, you'll, you know, here's where you'll name it. Now this, I'm going to show you that in one second. This is the like reveal tab. This uh, option here shows one piece of content to the viewer, and when they like the page and become a fan, they show them the another set of content, which is uh, um, how they get their free gift, or you know, it's user content that is more valuable. So it creates a, uh, your fan base uh, will grow. It creates a viral effect. So anyway. Here's where you would edit. Like I said, this is just demo text. You change any of this, add your opt-in code. This doesn't have to be an opt-in page. It can be a sales page. It can be a personal page. Anything you want. Um, I just put it as a squeeze page. It's uh, more directed towards business. Uh, you can add video, um, pictures. You can um, align it center, align it to the left, right. Uh, you can do just about anything you want here to create a page, and it's very simple. You don't need no programming knowledge whatsoever. So go back real quick to the dashboard, and here's, like I said, of the pages, okay? So we're going to set one up just to show you how quick and simple it is. I'm not going to go through and edit the page, but just to give you an idea. And again, this is a script, so you're going to have to install it on a server, which means you have to have your own hosting. HostGator.com is one of the best. About five hours a month, you can get the cheapest plan, and that'll work perfect for this. So, anyway, here's where you uh, we're going to go over to uh, Facebook. Okay, now here's where I created my application, which you're going to have to do that too. It's very simple. There's instructions how to do that. Okay, um, I've already did a little bit of the process to speed it up, but basically here it is. I've created it. Okay, over here. This is my fan page that I just created. You can see it's blank. There's no other tabs besides uh, the get started ball and info. Okay, so everything's brand new. What we're going to do, I want the first squeeze page, okay? So you click on this hourglass, uh, magnifying glass, excuse me. Okay, here's the page. Okay, now if this is the page that I want to show up, matter of fact, hold on one second here. And when you add in a page, I'm getting a step ahead of myself. When you want to add a page, here you'll see the app ID and the app secret code. Over here on Facebook where I created that, you'll find that up top here. I've already added them in, but 
they will be required in order for your page to show up and the like reveal code to work so as you can see I've already added mine okay let me hit save changes okay make sure this one is set the same way okay okay I want that you hit the magnifying glass here's the page in the address bar you copy it hit control C to copy it we're going to go over to our um, app where we created our app you see up here canvas URL and again we're under the Facebook integrations tab right here control V okay and then we want to make sure it says auto resize for the uh, iframe size and down here we're going to name the tab uh, and I'm going to name it welcome okay hit save okay now I want to go to the application profile page so I can add the tab to my brand new fan page okay so on this side you see add add to my page click it you have a little pop-up box here these are your fan pages that's the one I just created add to my page close go to accounts Okay, under here you'll see there's my page. Let's click it. And there you go. You see my new tab has been added. Let's click on it and I'll show you what the uh, fan page looks like. And remember, it's uh, unedited. It's just a demo. There you go. Edit instantly. So this is the first squeeze page, okay? And... Uh, Right. of course like I said you need to edit it doesn't have to be a squeeze page you don't need to add opt-in code if you don't want to build a uh, email lists it can be a sales page personal page anything you want okay it can be completely edited and uh, let's go back over to your control panel on the dashboard okay and right here on the dashboard I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to edit it okay squeeze page one hit save changes let's go back over to Facebook hit reload and there you go you see that it's instantly updated so you can create and manage your fan pages right from your dashboard and your control panel and the, the updates are instant you can change the font colors change the video add pictures anything you want from right inside of your editor and you just hit edit pages right in here it's uh, basically like a WordPress interface uh, but better have you have more options you can center them you can style uh, change the font size bold italics underlines add videos pictures all kind of stuff so uh, it's pretty simple to do now what I'm going to show you uh, now that we've updated it uh, real quick let's go back I'm sorry for hitting that under your settings okay uh, this is where you have two options. This is to change the template color, which I'll show you real quick. We'll change it to red. And split testing, which uh, we'll go over that in a minute. We won't enable that yet, but we'll go over that in a minute. Okay, hit uh, save. And let's reload the fan page real quick. And there you go. Now it's a red uh, outline around it instead of blue. So, uh, simple to change instant changes uh, they're, they're made instantly right live on your fan page um, now we're going to go over uh, go back to the dashboard here we're going to go over uh, the like reveal first um, right here hit edit okay to like reveal it asks you right here make this uh, page visible to non fans right now anyone can see it uh, when I click this they're going to be required to like the page in order to see the next uh, uh, page of content which is for fans only so let me save it real quick and I'm going to show you how this will work okay let me hit reload okay now you'll notice it's a new page telling me to like the page to get my free gift it doesn't show me the squeeze page with the video uh, right away so you ha it's required to hit like you can tell I haven't liked it because the like buttons here so when I hit the like 
it's going to take me to the next page and show me the fan only content. Okay, you'll notice now, instead of it being the page that tells me to like them to get my free gift, I'm actually on the page where if I had an opt in code, I could opt in and get my free gift. And that's because I like the page. Now, what happens when you unlike the page? Well, you don't see the squeeze page any longer. You see the front page telling you to like their page to get your free gift. See, pretty simple. So that's how you uh, build a uh, larger fan base, uh, requiring them to like to see more content. And uh, let's go back to the dashboard. I'm going to uh, demonstrate the um, uh, split testing. And what the split testing will do will allow you to uh, rotate between two different uh, fan pages, uh, most preferably squeeze pages. And uh, that'll uh, um, determine if one is better than the other, uh, one has got a better response, or um, you know if your fans just like one better. So it's, uh, that's what it's good for. And uh, what you'll do is go under settings, and you'll hit yes, and then you'll hit your save changes. And let's go back to the fan page and hit reload and you'll notice this squeeze page one okay now let's reload it again okay you see that it's changed it's not squeeze page one anymore it's actually squeeze page two with a different heading uh, so that's how that option works uh, we're going to go back over here real quick it's pretty basic it's a pretty uh, easy uh, script and uh, very very easy for people to uh, use and build uh, fan pages so for those who uh, were in fear who had no programming knowledge no more fear this is your program this will do it for you for those who know how to build them this will still save you a lot of time so it's a good program for either one and uh, again thanks for watching and uh, please buy easy fan page creator uh, for a limited time it's uh, at a discounted rate. So thanks for watching again.